Hi, my name is Elsa Doman. I'm the Director of Teaching and Learning at Hillbrook School. One of the great things about the way that Hillbrook funds um, professional learning is not only how generous um, the funding is, but also how willing the school is to fund teachers' individual development. Um, and so the philosophy that we have of valuing individual students' learning paths, we extend to our adult community, um, making sure that we're really funding um, a broad range of areas that teachers and staff want to grow in. When teachers learn about areas of their practice that they're really curious about, um, that comes back to students not only as increased ability to teach that subject matter really expertly, but also increased enthusiasm, um, new um, examples of the way that that's lived out in the world, great new resources, uh, new project ideas that they might have gotten from peers at other schools during that professional learning. So the entire time that teachers are spending um, towards that professional learning all of that is coming back to create a richer, more real-world applicable um, best practice educational experience for students. One example of a way that teachers are staying on the cutting edge of instructional best practice is in math. We've been able in the past year to send multiple teachers to different mindset mathematics and visual mathematics workshops with people like Joe Bowler at Stanford, who's really leading a national conversation about how we engage students in different types of math activities that allow them to apply what they're learning to real world complex problems and also create um, math learning experiences that depend on student exploration, perseverance in a problem that may be very new or look very different to them, and where they're able to apply what they already know and where they're already strong to take different approaches to solving that problem. In addition to funding professional learning at external workshops, we fund teachers to develop collaboratively on campus. One way that students are benefiting from teacher fellowship time is when we have learned about a new method for instruction or a great new set of resources. Teachers who may have attended a workshop where they were trained um, in a new model are able to then work together to make sure that that new learning is spreading across teachers who share that grade level but may not have been able to attend that workshop so that all children in that grade level are experiencing that new set of resources or that new method. What matters to me about the funding that Hillbrook School spends on professional learning is how much it allows teachers to continue to um, be experts, to develop their craft, to remain engaged in a broader educational conversation on the disciplines and subject areas that they're responsible for leading for students, creating opportunities for teachers to have really rich experiences as learners themselves allows teachers to build empathy for the student experience of being a learner and also renews their uh, enthusiasm and expertise in a discipline that is always evolving so that they can return to the classroom ready to share that energy and new learning with students.